children. Good afternoon to you. You remember what we did last time? About animals and their babies. And I gave you homework. Hmm? So let's start off with the homework. We'll see what we, whether you have done it correctly. And then let's move on to today's lesson, right? Yeah, so let's see. So duck, these are animals and their homes, uh, animals and their babies, right? So duck, yeah, duckling, check your answers, children. And then owl, yeah, yeah, it's given, uh, cat, yeah, kitten, okay, what's the next one? Dog, puppy, cow, calf, sheep, sheep, lamb, right? So this is your homework. Hope you have done it. Um, yes, so I'm going to go to today's lesson. Right, so today, last week, last time we learned about animals and their young ones, babies. Today we are going to talk about their homes. Yeah, we also have animals in our homes, right? Pets. And let's see. So they have different homes. Can you identify these pictures, children? Hmm? Yeah, so we have a pond, we have a web here, nest. A den, yeah. So let's see. Let's go to the. Let's watch a video now. Um, watch it carefully. Last week we learned about baby animals, and today we are going to learn about um their homes. So we are going to combine both, right? Just watch. Mary has a sheep in the pen. Sheep. Has a baby, and the baby is called a lamb. Mary has a cow in the shed, cow in the shed, cow in the shed. The cow has a baby, and the baby is called a calf. Mary has a dog in the kennel, dog in the kennel, dog in the kennel, dog. Called a puppy. Mary has a cat in the house, cat in the house, cat in the house, cat has a baby, and the baby is called a kitten. Mary has a horse in the stable, horse in the stable, horse in the stable, horse has a baby. Duck in the pond, duck in the pond, duck in the pond, duck has a baby, and the baby is called a duckling. Mary has a goat in the pen, goat in the pen, goat in the pen, goat has a baby, and the baby is called a kid. Mary has a donkey in the stable, donkey in the stable, donkey in the stable. Let's go to the um, book now, children. Yes, so this is what you just watched, right? Most of the animals or creatures were there in the video. We are going to learn only a few among them, right? 
the B was in there in the video. Right, B. Let's go to the reader. Listen and say, B, where do you live? I live in a beehive. Mm -hmm. What is the question? These children want to know where the bee lives, right? So what is the reply? B says, I live in a beehive. Say it again. Let's start again. Hive. Bird. I live in a nest. What does the bird say? I live in a nest. So bird's home is the nest. The beehive is the home of the bee. Right? Yes. Nest. Rabbit. I live in a burrow. What does the rabbit say? I live in a burrow. Can you see the picture, children? I live in a burrow. So let's see. Burrow. Uh, let's see. Yes. Burrow. Yeah. So it's the home of the rabbit. Nest. In uh, Tamil. Yeah. In Sinhala. Mm. Right. Kudua. Paravai Kudu. Right. Nest. Yeah. So beehive again is where the bee lives. Right. The bird lives in a nest. Rabbit lives in a burrow. Let's go to the next page. Who are these animal friends? Who is this? Hmm? Lion, I live in a den. What does the lion say? I live in a den. Can you say after me? I live in a den. So this is a picture of a den. How to spell den, children? How to spell the word? Yeah, let us spell the word den. Okay, lion. L-I-O-N, lion. Lion. How to spell den? Den. D-E-N, den. Yeah, what did the lion say? I live in a den. Den. Dog. I live in a kennel. What did the dog say? I live in a kennel. How to spell kennel? So you can see the picture. I don't think I need to show you the picture. See the kennel. Yeah. How to pronounce this word? Let's see how to pronounce this word. Kennel. Kennel. Right? Yeah. And then how to spell this? K-E-N-N-E-L. Kennel. Yes. And who is next? Kennel. Hen, I live in a coop. Coop. Where does the hen live? In a coop. Right? So coop. Coop. You might have seen, you no, know, in villages, even in villages we see people rearing hens for eggs. And we have this coop. Right? Yeah. What do we have coop. next? Fish. We. Where does a fish live? We live in a pond. Mm, we live in a pond. So where does a fish live? In a pond. Yeah. Okay, very nice. So we saw a lot of animals and their homes, right? So what are the animals we saw? The creatures. We have bee. Bee lives in a beehive. We have the bird. Where does the bird live? Yeah, in a nest. Okay, and the rabbit. Pronounce his word. Pronounce his word. Uh-huh. Yeah, this is the picture of a burrow. How to pronounce the word? Hmm? Burrow. Right? Yes. So we know that the rabbit lives in a burrow. And uh, lion lives in a den. The dog lives in a kennel. Hen lives in a coop. Fish. Yeah. They live in the pond, right? Sometimes we see them 
in the rivers, in the sea. Right. Let's go to the activities now, children. We are going to the PowerPoint presentation now. She spoke about animals. And now, this is what we just read in the reader. Mm -hmm. Right. So, as you can see, bee lives in a beehive. Yeah. Birds live in their nests. Rabbits in the burrow. Lion in the den. Dog in the kennel. Hen in the coop. Fish in the pond. Right. Okay. I have some more uh, places of their, their homes rather. Right. So. Yes, so let's do a few activities now. Right, this is what we are going to do. I will point out, you are going to tell me, you are going to read rather. Yeah, ready? So let me read the words first. This is the A column. Let me read the words. A bee, an ant, a duck. A tiger, a rabbit, a spider, a sparrow. Sparrow is a bird, children, right? Spider, we know. We have seen spider webs. Yeah. So, B, burrow. What is this? The nest. Yeah. Then we have the den, hive, pond, and tail. Okay. Yes, I missed the web. No, right, web. Right. Can you swear so to say a bee? Lives in a, I would say a bee lives in a, where? Beehive. A bee lives in a beehive. So where does an ant live? An ant lives in a, where? It has to be an. An ant lives in an, and till right an ant lives in an ant hill ant hill right okay duck where does the duck live hmm? duck where does it live a duck lives in a pond we don't have fish so we have a duck here what is the next one Tiger. Hmm? Earlier we saw the lion. Tigers also live in the den, children. Right? They all live in the forest. A tiger lives in a den. Okay? Uh, rabbit. You remember? Rabbit. Where does the rabbit live? Rabbit lives in a burrow. Spider. Where does the spider live? A spider lives in a where? Hmm? Web. Good. A sparrow? It's a bird. A sparrow? Yeah. A sparrow lives in a where? Hmm? Here we go. The nest. Okay. So shall we say it again? A bee. Say it with me. A bee lives in a beehive. An ant lives in an ant hill. A duck lives in a pond. A tiger lives in a den. A rabbit lives in a burrow. A spider lives in a web. A sparrow lives in a nest. Good. Right. So we are going to the next activity. Right. So learn the names carefully, children. Very important to know where they live. Right. So names, where they live. Very important. A bee lives in a beehive. 
lion lives in a den, tigers live in a den, yeah, and then fish, we can say pond, the sea, the river, you know, they live in water, yeah, who else, bird, bird, bird lives in a nest, hen, where does a hen live? A hen lives in a coop. How to spell coop? C double O P coop. And my next activity is I have given some pictures and you are going to fill in the blanks. And one, this last one doesn't have a sentence. You have to write the whole sentence. Okay? Ready? Can I start? Here we go. So we are going to do it collectively, right? Okay. Um, a hen lives in a yeah. This is the first one. Sorry, on top. Huh? The dog lives in a where? Yeah. Can you spell it? K E double N E N. Right. Yes, K E double N E L canal. Yeah, got it? Right. A lion lives in a yeah D E N den. Then what is this? Read it. A hen lives in a where? Coop. Spell the word coop. C Double O P coop. A fish lives in a. See that to me? What is the word? Yeah, pond. P O N D pond. And what is this? We have two blanks here. Yeah? What is this? A B. And what's the next word? A B, can you see? B double E, okay? Lives in a, how to spell? B hive. B hive. And the last one I have not written, you are supposed to write it. How to say? A bird. Complete it. A bird. Lives in a nest. A bird lives in a nest. Right? Yes. Check your answers, children. A dog lives in a kennel. A lion lives in a den. A hen lives in a coop. A fish lives in a pond. A beehive. A bee lives in a beehive. A bird lives in a nest. Done? Okay, so going to the next slide. So learn the words carefully and your spellings carefully. It's very important that you learn them carefully. To pronounce, to spell, very important. Right? Yes. So this is... These activities are taken to help you out in your learning activities. Yes, so let's see. So our next activity, what is it? Aha, uh -huh, your homework. So let's see what you have to do there. I have some new words also. Maybe you can get your teacher's help, your parents' help. You can have your dictionary, ask your parents, teachers about these new words also. Right? Okay. So have a nice week, children. We learnt about animals and their homes. So till we meet again. Bye-bye.